Oh. Got to keep her clean. What's up? It's Brendan from Garage Gym Guys. Happy Monday. Did a uh, squat workout today. Uh, Sean was actually over this weekend. And he was getting kind of lippy or chippy about how good his workouts have been. Um, my ego definitely felt it. So he did his last, let's see, his last workout of back squat with 275. And I think I did that a week or two ago. So I was like, all right, I'm getting off the mic. Let's let the, let's let the old man see, see who's in charge here. And I, I put a, did my warm up, did my bike warm up, did uh, some gymnastics like walking on the ground, get my hamstrings all loose, did some rolling around, uh, loosen up the spine. I put 225 on for back squatting. I felt like I was under a house. So I don't know, I, I narrowed up my stance a little bit. Um, uh, just, just trusted the process, did my reverse hypers in between. Uh, and then my, mon my banded lateral shuffles, monster walks or whatever. And uh, I just couldn't seem to get confident enough to, uh, to own any weight that was higher than 225 today for back squats. So it is what it is. I mean, it's five sets of five. Uh, you got the work in. It probably has something to do with how I'm not really taking care of my body on the weekends. Um, you know, I'm not looking at the whole equation. I'm only looking at, you know, one hour of the 24 hours in the day. So totally a mistake, but I've got work to do and it's good to be able to chase Sean uh, with his journey. So I think he's hanging out with all, all them young bucks in PT school. So he's uh, probably feeling charged. He's got that higher testosterone. Um, so then I tried to redeem myself a little bit. Uh, and then I went to uh, an EMOM, 20 minute alternating EMOM. And it actually turned out to be pretty awesome. Um, I got real high temperature in the body. I was laying on the ground after sucking and wheezing air, but it wasn't too bad. You know, it was that perfect uh, amount of heart, sustained heart rate, whatever number that is. I don't collect data on that right now, um, but it felt awesome. So here's the EMOM. Um, I did, uh, I brought, I put two uh, of my bumpers on the ground. I've got the wide HG bumpers, so it was uh, about seven inches high. And I picked up two of my kettlebells and did 10 reverse lunges. So five each leg um, off, the, uh, off the bumpers. And what I liked about it is it got that single leg depth um, that helped translate to my squat. It was real nice to get that flex in the knees, um, but it took the pressure off the spine. That's why I like the single leg stuff. I think I'm going to start picking up more of that um, as we go on these next few weeks. I can feel like I'm getting a little biased towards the, uh, the neutral stance. Okay, so I did the 10 total double kettlebell reverse lunges. Love reverse lunges, getting into the hamstring and the glutes. I actually had a little bit of a butt cramp. I was excited about it. Um, then, honestly, my pull-ups have been sucking because of my elbows. And I think, I, like I said, I really gotta get back on that horse. You know, I can't just keep shying away from doing inverted rows and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, you can't be, uh, can't be afraid to uh, uh, hanging out there. So I did uh, banded pull-ups. Um, I used my, uh, this guy, um, I, I actually don't even remember where I ordered it. It's a cheap band. It's, it, it's got, it's starting to fray, but, uh, so I don't know if it's like a true poundage that you can measure, but yeah, the banded pulls were nice. I got, I got a, a good, um, tracking of the elbows. I did five reps. I got a good squeeze at the top. So it was nice. It was a nice, uh, change. Nice to be able to pick up some, some of that stuff. And, uh, we always did pull-ups on, uh, I feel like we did pull-ups off at Michigan State uh, on, on leg days. I just think you can't do enough rowing. So, um, yeah, that's what it was. Alternating EMOM, 20 minutes, uh, 10 reverse lunges, five of these pull-ups. I'm telling you, it sounds simple. I really only did uh, five sets of five squat, uh, some, <laughs> you know, shuffles and some reverse hypers and then an alternating EMOM. But that's all you need on a weekday sometimes. It's a good win. Tomorrow we'll be back for... Um, bench squat press. We'll be doing some overhead press stuff and I'm excited to do those double kettlebell. They're like an upright row swing. I just think about those all week. That's just gotta get back to overhead press day. It's my favorite. Cheers.